guys, it's Olivia and welcome back to my channel, Olivia Grace. And for today's video, I'm going to be doing a Ipsy unboxing. So in case you don't know, I um, got Ipsy. I got it for Easter from the Easter Bunny. So um, I've gotten about two or three bags, I think. But yeah. So basically, Ipsy is a subscription. You get five products for $10 a month. And you get it every month. So I really think Ipsy is a great deal. I've gotten a bunch of products I like so far. Every now and then there's a product that I don't really, I mean, I, it's not that I dislike, but it's just I don't really use it that much. But yeah. Before we get started, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Let's get on with the video. So first, when you get your Ipsy, it is in a pink bag. By the way, I haven't seen any of these products. So yeah, I had to wait a while, so I had to be really patient because usually I'm really anxious and I'm like, I need to open this, I need to open it, but I waited just to film it on camera. So when you open it up, it just has the seal, ooh, that came off really easily, and let's look inside. So I'm going to pull out the bag, three, two, one. Oh my god, this is so cute! I love all the bags, so like, I say all the, them are cute. So it looks like there's some like different it's just airmail it's probably a bunch of different stamps in places from around the world that's really cute so on the back it was just a coral color and then it had a white color yeah sorry yellow color on the front so now that we know what the bag looks like in the outside we're gonna open it up so the first product i'm just gonna pull out product by product and the first product i pull out is a Perfume, I think. That's really cool. I actually have been needing a new perfume. I have a few perfumes, like the Taylor Swift, the Ariana Grande, one that she, like, first came out with. And then I also have just some, like, Bath and Body Works and a Victoria's Secret one. But this is really cool. So I've never heard of this brand before named Kenzie, but the perfume actually smelled really good. So, yeah. It just, I really liked it. And it just had this little cute white packaging. And then it just, that's just the ingredients. So now that we have the perfume, we're going to take it out of the box and smell it. So it looks like it has some kind of little note inside. Oh, okay. This is a Kenzie Loving Life. That's the brand. Sorry, I forgot to say it. It says, become a fan, free gift, kenziefragrance.com slash fans. So I guess it's a little, oh, it's a little key button. On the back it says, 50% off, 3.4 fluid ounces, um, bottle of perfume or a gift set that's really cool so inside the bottle it was kind of just your standard uh perfume bottle it's just black and it had this really cutie cute black and white detail so this is kind of a standard bottle of mini perfume sample just as kenzie loving life like i said and now i'm going to spray it and smell it oh my god i love that scent literally that is like i'm not just saying it because it's an ipsy bag or whatever but it, see, it has kind of like a clean scent, a hint of a clean, but it has like kind of floral kind of, but it is like a really, really, oh my god, I just want to put some on. Let me give my opinion again. It just really has kind of like a florally kind of clean, it, it almost smells like summer, like a summer scent. It really smells good. The next product is a sponge. Oh my god, I really wanted to try a new sponge. So it is the... Uh, Shimmy Glam, can't really read it, sponge. So this is what the sponge looks like. It's just a little pink sponge. So I'm not going to test the sponge out now, but I will test it out probably in a future video of like first impressions or something like that. But I am really excited to try this sponge. I'm going to pull out the next product, and it is... Sorry, my stomach. The product is... Oh my gosh. Oh my god, guys. Literally, I'm so excited. This is a Huda Beauty lip contour lip liner. Oh my god. What shade is this in? It is in the shade Trophy Wife. Oh my gosh. So this is what the Huda Beauty lip liner looked like, and it was in a really pretty color. Just to let you guys know, I've never ever tried one of these lip liners before. So when you open the container up, this is what you get. This little Trophy Wife lip liner. And I've actually never tried one of these, which I'm really excited for, like, honestly. It's actually kind of, like, it kind of matches the color I'm wearing today. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I'm going to put some on. So, the lip liner is this really pretty mauve, purpley pink mauve. shade. 
Sorry for the background noise, but that was not accurate, like swatching at all. I don't know what was wrong with the lighting. This is what these two, sh well, the one shade looks like. I just swatched it two times, and it is so creamy, honestly. And actually, it comes a lot. You can sharpen this. Yes. Oh my gosh. Kylie literally rips you off with hers. Like, not on your throat shade. Oh my gosh, this noise. But, anyways, she kind of rips you off because you don't like get to roll it up like this one's kind of roll up but like you can tell this type of tip like you can roll this up but this is really good because i love being able to use my lip liner more than what is just in the tip i'm gonna pull out the next product and it is oh my gosh what is this it is a mini matte blur stick blurry and primer and shine erase it's a blurring primer and it like erases the shine in your face. And it is in by Trisique, I think is something it. Trisique? Yeah. This is what the primer looks like. It's just kind of in a stick form and uh, yeah, that's what it looks like. So as you saw, it is a blurring primer and it actually looks really good. It kind of has a nude kind of color to it, like I said. And yeah, it feels really soft when you put it on. Like it doesn't look like anything because like, right here, I think, yeah. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited to try this. Plus I just love getting new primers. Like primers are one of the most important um, things with your makeup. So I'm really glad I got this in my empty bag. Okay guys, we are down to the final product. I don't know what it is, guys. I do not know what it is. I'm praying it is good. Maybe like some, I don't know, just like eyeshadow. We haven't really had any of that in the bag. We like eyeliner, eyebrows, stuff like that. And the last product is, oh my gosh. Okay, guys, the last Ipsy product in my bag was this pop little eyeshadow. This is what the eyeshadow looks like from Pop Beauty or whatever, and it's just kind of this really pretty goldeny colored eyeshadow. Goldeny! <laughs> It was actually really pigmented, too. As you see when I swatched it, it was really, really metallic. And it also does come out of the little container, so if you want to put it in, like, a Z palette or something, you can. Okay, guys, I'm honestly so excited and so, literally, look at that pigment there. That is so pigmented. Overall, I just really love my Ipsy bag. I mean, come on, this bag, like, all the bags are so cute. And I just love Ipsy overall. Like, I know I keep saying it, but, like, I look forward every month to literally... Like, getting the Ipsy bag is so fun to, like, unbox, like, get it. So, thank you guys so, so much for watching today's video. Oh, my God, what is that? It looks like there's something like a wart right here. Mm. Once again, thank you guys so, so much for watching today's video. Don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. See you guys. See you guys in my next video. Bye.